Hi, I'm JJ Snyder. You're watching Mingle Media TV's Red Carpet Report. Tonight I'm at the International Documentary Association's 2011 Awards Gala, recognizing excellence in documentary film. Oh. Great, and what are you working on now? A film about pain. It's called The Story of Pain, about a guy named Dr. Sarno. Dr. Sarno wrote a book in the 70s called Healing Back Pain, sold millions of copies. Every, everybody, Howard Stern talks about him all the time, um, but there's no media about him. It's really nuts. And um, he's incredibly effective at what he does, but he's 88 years old, so time is of the essence. Ooh, this sounds really interesting. Yeah. yeah, yeah it's, Have you personally had an experience with pain? That I was stuck on the floor all summer. Uh, I was. Um, and I had actually seen him in the past. And he's incredibly helpful. There was actually a joke about him the other night on Board to Death, you know, the TV show. And so I contacted the writer-director, so I'm going to take him to meet Dr. Sarno. He had back problems, read the book and got better, so he's very excited. So we're going to kind of weave in all kinds of ideas about media and how stories move through the world. Because there is no media about him, but you can't meet five people without two of them knowing who he is. Which is really, it's crazy. Like if you go on YouTube, there's one 2020 piece from 1987. And that's oh. it. Great. It sounds like you found a gem. Do you discuss uh, prescription painkillers in this? That is going to be a, a part of the story. One of the, one of the crazy things we just found out is that in 2001, pain cost Americans, chronic pain, $211 billion. Heart disease was like 60, right? And we're not even aware of it. In 2010, it was 500 billion. 2011, 613 billion. And we all kind of wonder, where's, why is healthcare cost rising so much? It's because because of chronic pain, and it didn't exist 50 years ago. So what, what's going on? Like, our bodies didn't just fall apart. I'm, I'm very intrigued. When can we expect to see the film out? You know, it'll probably take a year or two. But we've been, we've been shooting for four or five years, and we're just really cranking it back up again now that um, wow. we're done with this project. Yeah. Wow. Best of luck. We look forward to seeing it. Thank you. Thank you yes. very much.